Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to Captain Quality. Today we got this 2006 BMW 650i. We're just doing a battery replacement. It's pretty straightforward, nothing too complicated. It requires an H9 AGM battery. Extremely important to make sure it's an AGM, just due to the high voltage these cars need. Uh, very simple to go, go about it. The battery is located here in the trunk. I'll show you guys how it's done. All right, all you're really gonna need is a 10 millimeter with an impact gun, very easy. You just wanna disconnect the positive terminal, negative terminal, a couple of hold downs for the battery. Pull this out. Get the new one in there. All right, make sure you get the battery acid bleeder hose in. It just pops right here into the side. Very easy. Position the battery, get it scooted all the way back. Hook up the positive. Before we put the negative, we're just gonna put down the tie downs. Impact one, two, hook up your terminals, tighten them. Awesome, simple as that, guys. Real easy. Make sure you put your all the trunk belongings back into place. Now, for the most important part of this job. Extremely important, you got to program the battery. We will be doing that with the scan tool. I'll show you guys how that goes now. All right guys, so we're gonna reprogram this battery, register it into the car's computing system. I have a Maximus 2.0, so here's how I'm gonna go about by doing it. You wanna hit BMW, because that's what we're working on. Hit okay. We want to do an automatic search just to get all the vehicle info. Hit next. Okay. You want to hit health report. This will scan every computing system into the car. All right, and you could clearly see that we were getting low voltage codes. Um, we already ran a battery test on this car, so we knew it needed a battery from the beginning. So you wanna go under engine control module. Down at the bottom, go to special functions. Scroll to the very bottom. 
Register battery replacement. Perform battery registrate. Register battery. Now, due to we put the exact same battery in there, so we're gonna put enter battery replacement with same capacity. So that would be number one. Battery replacement set successfully registered into DME. Perfect, and you're all set. Once you do that, the car is good to go. You can start it right up. And while you're at it, every time you replace a battery, you wanna reset your clock over here onto the main screen, just so you have the correct time and whatnot. Other than that, she's good to go. All right, guys, that sums up today's video on how to replace a battery on a 650. Stay tuned for more. We'll be posting more and more videos every single day. Thanks for tuning in to Captain Quality. Like, subscribe. That will really help us out. Thank you. See you on the next episode.